So in this example, we're being asked to divide two rational expressions. Now, when we are working with division with rational expressions, the first thing that we want to do is multiply by the reciprocal of the denominator. So in other words, we are going to flip this rational expression. So now that we've multiplied by the reciprocal of the denominator, that second rational expression, notice that we've changed this division with rational expressions into simply a multiplication with rational expressions. So we know that to multiply two rational expressions, we're going to need to factor the numerator and denominator of both of the rational expressions completely, and then we can simplify by canceling like terms. So in our first initial factoring, we have factored the first rational expression completely. And then observe with our second rational expression, we factored out the greatest common factor of x in the numerator and are left with the difference of squares. And in the denominator, we're working with a perfect square trinomial. So we can factor the second expression further. So now that we have finished factoring both terms completely, we're ready to simplify by combining this rational, this product of two rational expressions to a single rational expression and then canceling our like terms. So we can see lots of great simplification happening. We have a 2x plus 3 in the numerator and denominator, so those terms will cancel each other out to 1. We can also see this x minus 4 in the numerator and denominator. So those terms cancel out to 1. And we have another common factor, x minus 25. Again, both in the numerator and denominator. So canceling all those like terms, we are left with our simplified rational expression, x times x plus 25, all divided by 2x plus 3. 